Hello there. My name is Peter Thompson and this is one of my top tip series. And this one's really simple. And it won't apply to everyone, but for people who find it difficult to turn their shoulders round in the first part of the swing, this will help a lot. I taught one man, he was a scratch golfer, which is obviously extremely good, but he struggled a little bit with turning round. Now all teachers, all good teachers will almost guarantee that the shoulder turn is a very, very important part of the swing. I think it's extremely important. If the shoulder turn and the hip turn isn't in the swing, then you will tend to move your arms and then you get a very narrow swing and a very wristy swing and a very flicky swing. So most teachers, good teachers, would agree the shoulder turn is important. The men will always agree when the turn should happen, but they all agree it is important. I think the turn, shoulder turn, hip turn, should happen straight away along with the arm movement and with the wrist movement. Some people struggle in turning around soon enough and they tend to move their arms. Well this top tip is about your right arm almost forcing your shoulders to turn round. Well, what's this? No club, no ball. Form a triangle between your left arm, right arm, shoulders. If I don't move my hips or my shoulders, my right arm will bend. My left arm will stay fairly straight, but my right arm will bend. We don't really want that. So this top tip is, when you start back, keep your right arm straighter. And by keeping your right arm straighter, you now have to turn your shoulders. You have no choice. They have to turn. On this side, right arm not moving, bending in here. Keep the right arm straight and your shoulders are guaranteed to turn. If you watch Jack Nicklaus on YouTube or wherever, he was phenomenally good at turning around. And if you watch him carefully, the right arm in his takeaway was above the left arm. And even this far back in the swing, he had the right arm above the left arm. And that makes him turn around. I'm not saying he tried to do that on purpose. And what I'm saying is that that's what he did. So if you struggle with turning soon enough, just try this. This will work beautifully. Keep your right arm straight. Right arm straight. Right arm. Above the left arm. And that will give you a, a very good early turn, which is important. So if you don't turn, the club head now will be here, sort of just on the edge of the mat. If I turn round a lot sooner, the club head now is beyond the edge of the mat, much, much wider. And in the swing, you need to keep the swing as wide as possible. And to achieve that, you need to turn. If you struggle with turning, just keep your right arm straight. There, with or without a ball. There, it makes you turn. I hope you find that interesting. I hope you find that useful. If you do turn, then you don't need this top tip anyway, but if you do struggle with turning soon enough, then this will work beautifully. Thank you for listening. Thank you very much.